Oh my god, that is so much fun. Look at our character, he's so happy. Oh, that is amazing. That is so cool. Hey everyone, my name is James and welcome back to Starbound. Now in the last episode we were searching this floor and planet and we actually happened to kind of like stumble across a lot of artifacts that are helping with our main quest. As you can see here we're about 55% through it and um, we have a few more artifacts to find but at the end of the episode we started stumbling across this little area here where there was like men trying to kill us and such and I was really good because I wanted to record more of it but uh, we'd run out of time so today I've come back and we're going to continue with what we were doing yesterday I'm also going to grab all this ore as well because this ore is probably going to be useful now I'm a little bit tired today and for those who follow me on Twitter and those who keep up to date with the kind of stuff that I post about um, you may know why I'm tired and it's actually because uh, yesterday or last night rather, well, technically still today, um, a new Harry Potter book released. And as a very British person, and as somebody who thoroughly enjoyed that literature when I was a child, I went to a midnight launch for the book because I was like, hey, midnight launches are kind of cool. And so I went to this midnight launch and then I spent all night reading the book. Um, and so I'm kind of knackered today, but I feel fulfilled, so that's okay. And I'm super excited because I was just so excited to record Starbound today and I didn't want to do it until I had fully, fully finished uh, the new book, so I'm really happy. Right, now, I was reading through all of your comments yesterday. Um, a lot of you agreed that selling the weapons I'm not going to use is probably a smart idea, because there's so many to, so many to choose from, and everyone's like, hey, there are a few people out there that are like, no, don't sell any, because they're all awesome. But the thing is, like, as we, if we don't use them, we're going to out-level them. Um, like, we're going to find new ones and, like, better ones. So, kind of hoarding on to weapons is probably not, like, the best idea. Um, is there any ore up here that I want to grab? I just want to, before we go down there, I know that there's a person. I just want to kill anybody that I could. Um, so, I'm going to sell the weapons. And what I'm going to do with the cast is I'm going to buy a hover bike. And that's going to be cool. But I'll show you my inventory real quick. We're up to 5,500. So, I'm hoping that we can get enough soon. Alright, okay. You again! <laughs> Us again. Alright, let's put up a electric charge. This thing is awesome, by the way. If you want to stop people coming after you, put up a little electrical charge. There we go. Come on. Stop, stop, stop. Alright, is there anything to scan in this area? No, but there is a chest. A chest! Let's open it. What's it got in it? A mana to con celestial ledge. Or celestial edge. Damage per swing, 5.1. Rate of fire, 1.9. Man, that is a, that's a pretty fast weapon, that is. But, like, for example, I'm not enjoying, um, like, short contact melee weapons. So, like, for example, that's probably one of the ones I would sell. But, um, yeah, but I don't think it's bad to sell weapons. I feel like if you're not going to use them uh, and they don't get to be used, then selling them to get something that we're going to use a lot is kind of a smart idea. And the thing is, like, there are so many weapons in this game and there's so many variations... Like, each weapon is slightly different. There are a few weapons in the game that are kind of consistent, but they're still um, they're still different in some little way. Like, for example, you could get a sword that's like a flamethrower, but there'll be different variations of it. So, that's kind of cool. I like stuff like that. Alright, these guys are uh, kind of fast approaching. Let's put up another electric wall. And let's heal up a little bit. Let's put down a torch. Okay, how many is that? See, that dude just looks like a pirate. Hmm. Okay, let's stab him. Oh, and electrocute him. Oh, no. Electrocute. No. 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 There we go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. He is defeated. Oh. Good. A fight. I was almost bored. Ah, yeah. Get cocky now, boy. Yeah. Let's see what this area is all about, though. There's a chest. Oh, there's two chests. Let's see if we can hop our way up to there. Hop. No. Okay, we're going to have to build a little bit. So let's come up here. We are running out of space very quickly, though. That is one big worry. All right, well, they're just pixels, so that's not too bad. And they are bombs. Oh, my God, they look like the um, look like the bombs from uh, Mario. Oh, they're cool. Oh, no, the bombs from Bomberman? I, I can't remember what I'm getting confused with. I'm getting confused with these. They look like some kind of bombs that I've seen before. Do you know what? I'm going to grab, while I can, I'm going to grab these chests as well, because they're actually kind of nice. We could uh, use these on our ship. So let's grab these two. And if we decide to go back up to the surface, we can uh, grab the other ones as well. Because we did pass a lot of these, actually. 
Oh, there we go. <laughs> Alright, two iron chests. Yeah, so I did a trial room. I think it was episode three or episode four, um, but I lost to it. I never spoke about it again. It's because I uh, I edited it out afterwards because you could, when I went back there, you couldn't go back in. So we're going to do it again um, and see what we can do. I don't know what this one's going to be about. The last one was a jumping puzzle. This one could be a combat puzzle. So let's see. Oh, wow, it's a little bit more intense now. Okay, flames. Yep, let's go. So yeah, so to my understanding, you get one chance at the... Oh, cr crud. Okay, let's heal up. Right, I thought that was going to be um, a platform above it. Okay, I like this stuff. Alright. Let's do this. Man, this area is cool. Yeah, so basically you find these randomly. They're apparently, they're not too rare. They're like a little bit rare. Um, but you find them essentially. And if you can complete them, you may get a prize. But if you don't complete them, um, or if you die, you don't get to, uh, you know, you don't get to do them again. You just have to wait until you find the next one. I wondered if that was going to be a time puzzle then. So I'm just trying to do this as fast as I can. Oh, F, no. Oh, let me back in there. Please let me back in there. Oh, no. Oh, we could have got that. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Right, I'm really annoyed by myself at that. Oh, if only it would let us back out again. Oh, I bet that's awesome. I bet that chest is so good. Oh, that's so annoying. Do we go into F-ball here? Right, okay. That's a bit of a risky business anyway. Ah, yeah, more of these guys. Okay, so you can kind of tell we are in the, their area because this quest is probably related to them. All right, heal up. Do as much as we can. We should really work on the... Ooh, no, no, no. We should really work on the people with guns first. Come on, come at me, boys. No, 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 no. Okay. All right, so there is... No, oh, God, he's got a shotgun. Right, we need to get the people with the guns. Come on. Come on, we can do this. Heal up, take another shot. Take another stab at it. Come on. That spread, though. Ooh. Do we have any... F ah, I know. Let's work on some at long range. Oh, that's not doing much, is it? Oh, no. Come on. Stab, stab, stab. No, 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 no. Okay, heal up, heal up, heal up. All right, we need to get out of here. Okay. A sword person I can deal with. No, 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 no. Come on. Alright, we just need to get away from the people with guns. No, 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 no. Don't think you're getting out of this one easily. That's what I was thinking as well. I was thinking, hey, easy getaway. I even run away. Oh, I need to equip more potions, but I can't because we're in heated combat. Nope. There we go. Okay. I get a reward chest. Oh my god, a Zylai... I Ephus Lance, a tech card, some tungsten, and some knives. Awesome. Do we actually get to keep that? And I think that's it. I'm really good that we missed that secret chest, though. Return to the world. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, I'm super good. I, I missed that chest. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I wonder what it could have had. Let's see what that weapon actually is, though. This uh, Xylite Aether Slice. Aether Lance. Oh, so it's kind of like, it's kind of running the mill, to be honest. Let's test it on a weapon, on an, <laughs> let's test it on an enemy, though. What do you think? Do you think it's a little bit stronger than what we used to? I think it's a little bit stronger. I don't know if it's, like, that much stronger. Okay. Yeah, no, uh, you know what? It's not too bad, is it? I mean, yeah, it's good. I think, yeah, I think it's definitely better. Okay, so it's fine to, it's time to, like, finally do this quest. Um, and we got 40, we got some pixels. Okay. Next, Florin needs to make a trade with traveling merchant Milka. Florin going uh, to give them six bones to get a plant fiber. The merchant arrived near the entrance of the old mine shaft to the west some time ago. Could you make the trade? Yeah, I can do that because she actually like kind of lives with us. Although she doesn't technically live with us. All I did was build a house around her so she couldn't leave. Um, which, is a, which is a little cruel when you think about it. Right, so what I'm going to do now... 
is I'm going back up to the top of my ship and I'm going to come back down again. And we're just going to take a look at uh, some crafting recipes because we've gotten to the point now where we've got quite a lot of tungsten and that means that we can make the next set of armor. And for the next set of armor, you need a few cotton balls. Now, I think I've got two, so I might wait until some cotton grows out and actually uh, craft the final set. All right, so let's see. Let's uh, say hello. Thanks for the goods. Here's Lamash's eight plant fiber. All right, so while we wait for the corn, uh, the cotton to grow, rather, I'm going to uh, return with that plant fiber, go and give it to uh, the merchant, and then we'll see what we get. Okay, we're back, so let's see. Awesome. Right, Florin has heard that Shiner is a traveling merchant that will trade desired goods in exchange for a plant fiber. Please take them to them at the small pond ruin west of us and help boost the popularity of Florin shop. Okay, so it's that way. So let's um, let's go and do that quest. And once again, like once again, I'm just going to jump cut there. Since this is our starting world and we know it pretty well, um, I'm going to jump cut there. And then um, I'm still waiting for the cotton to grow. So once that's grown, we can um, we can enjoy that. Oh, there you go. <laughs> all right, so let's return back. All right, that wasn't actually too bad at all. That was not a distance. I mean, that guy could have probably have done that. I mean, with the bones and everything. Yeah, I can understand why he didn't go and get that. But still. Could have at least handed his things to her. <laughs> awesome. So we got a reward bag for that. So let's open up that reward bag. Oh, and it kind of, he potters away. He's like, that's it. I'm done. All right, let's open this up. So, <laughs> copper ore. Wow. <laughs> I didn't think I've ever seen one that rubbish. That was pretty naff, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, and uh, that traveling merchant kind of teleported away. Hmm. Man, our world is getting less and less, um, I don't know, it's got less and less people now. I mean, that guy's running away, the traveling merchant's left, the pro the person with the fez is probably left. <laughs> Although, I don't know, I don't think she can, if, if she can beam out, that'd be good, but she's been kind of like kicking it up at our place, you know, hanging around with the other wanderer for quite a long time now. I mean, I feel like she's got intentions to stay. All right, so when we go back, hopefully we've got cotton. Cotton does take a little bit of time in this game to grow, though, I've noticed. But, okay, there we go. Smack these dudes. Man, I'm in love with this hammer. It's ace. But, there we go. Okay, let's see if the cotton's grown. Although, these guys take two hits, and then they got babies as well. So, hiya. Hiya. <laughs> they are now dead. All right, okay, our cotton still hasn't grown, but we do have a carrot. Right, so I'm going to do a little jump cut once again. I'm going to wait for the cotton to grow. I'm going to potter around and do some stuff, and then we shall see. All right, so I'm about to sell some of our old weapons that we don't use anymore. So I'm going to sell these up, and we get 1,100 credits, which is going to give us a khaki-painted hoverbike from Stored Nanites. Ah, oh, but which one do we get, though? This is the thing. These are a little bit more expensive. To be honest, I'm happy with the khaki one, so I'm going to buy the khaki one, and uh, here we go. Traveling in style, so we get our own hover bike, which is awesome. Um, let's try this out. Okay. Oh my god, that is so much fun. Look at our character, he's so happy. Oh, that is amazing. That is so cool. Ooh. All right, okay, they're a little bit hard to control. Oh, they're a bit janky, aren't they? You have to really kind of... Uh you know, be careful with these. They they do smash around a lot. I mean, it can't all be smooth sailings, can it? Oh my god! Remember where you parked your hover bike? Okay. Let's uh, let's see. What are some what are these things then? Upgrading components. A crucial upgrade. A crucial component of vehicle repair. Huh. That is so cool. Can you just stick it out anywhere you want, or do you have to put it back inside of it again? Oh, that's so cool. I love it so much. I actually love it so much. Let's, um, we're going to go back to our home planet now. Go and check the cotton. Hopefully craft up some armor, but I am so happy with that. That is awesome. I'm so happy with that. That, like, that literally turned out better than I thought it would. I had no idea what they looked like, um, but I'm so happy with that. That is cool. I just need to know how if, if there's any tips to kind of controlling it without breaking it. I mean, I imagine this thing's going to get beat pretty easily, isn't it? Let's uh, let's take that down and put it back in. Awesome. Is the cotton grown yet? Nope, the cotton has not grown. Right, I'm going to have to wait a little bit then. 
Okay, so the cotton has now grown, so we can use this to actually craft ourselves um, some new armor, which is really, really cool. Um, I'm excited to make some new ones. I know we're probably not ready for the Dread Wing yet, um, but I want to see it anyway. So we get a scavenger's um, breastplate, which we're going to forge. A scavenger's helmet, which we're going to forge. Oh, it actually takes a bit of time. I probably didn't finish that breastplate, did I? No, okay. Let's do the trousers. The scavenger trousers contain woven layers of protection. Right, okay, cool. So, let's see. Let's look at our inventory now. Alright, we have two pieces, but why can't we craft the last piece? Oh, we're out of wool again. I thought... Hmm, how many do we have? One, one. Oh, maybe it's because I didn't actually craft up the wool. There we go. Okay, let's craft the uh, the breastplate. Man, look at that. 2,400. I, I was always told that that was the value of the actual material. Like, the value of everything. Right, so we can take off our scouter gear. So, we currently have 25 defense. We're going to replace everything. We're also going to be taking off the helmet for a little while. And let's replace this. So we had 25 bef defense before, and now we have 45, which is pretty mad when you think about it. That is kind of mad. Um, do we keep the helmet on or not? Or do we go with the wings rather than the... I think the wings are my favorite. And then I'm going to um, I'm gonna go take a hat, or I'll probably grab a hat from our spaceship. But that is so cool. Right, so what we're going to do now is we are going to go back up to our planet... And uh, we're going to travel back to the Floran planet again, where we were scanning a bunch of Floran items. And we are going to basically hover back around the other side of the planet and go and find it. What's this one? Um, where does it tell you the name? That's a good point. Bookmarks. Um, Floran planet. There we go. Right, so this one. This is why I'm glad we do uh, things. Spo huh. Do you know what? I've not been getting graphics like this. But that's cool. So how come I don't have any fuel left? That's a good question. Oh, did I not? Oh, there you go. You have to click fuel and then it will give you fuel. All right, that's kind of funny, to be honest. Okay. Right, let's go and hover bike around this planet. Let's go grab us a hat anyway. So there's the mining hat. Uh, I'm not too keen on that one. The pirate hat. Kind of cool. Let's go with the space helmet. It looks a little bit stupid. Hmm. I kind of like just having a natural haircut, but you can't exactly have that, can you? Unless you've got, hmm. Oh, the protective arm. Oh, man. That brings me back to the start of the series. Do you remember this one? <laughs> this weird one? That's dead weird. Right, what about the fancy hat? <laughs> Alright, okay, I'm not going to go with the fancy hat. I'll have to just go with this armor for now. Um, Alright, let's beam down and let's go to the left because before we went to the right. Okay, let's place down our ship. And I think the key with this is to actually take it a bit slower um, and not kind of bang it around a lot. Like, if you're going to bang it around, the trick is to kind of go fast um, and then speed down when you want to, when you come into an area where you should probably slow down. Ooh, that was bad. That took a lot of damage then. I don't know where it actually says the um, where it actually says the health of the ship, but I imagine we'll probably just start noticing very soon. Oh my god, it's so clunky, but it's like brilliant at the same time. Like I love it, I absolutely love it. Um, right, let's go down here slow. Uh, okay, okay, okay. God, it's so hard to control, but I love it. I love it so much. Right, okay, let's come over here. Um, we just need to find a few more avian, uh, it's not avian, flora and stuff. So we're looking for like houses and such. Okay, we're trapped. Um, let's kill everybody. Hi, yeah. Uh, then hi, yeah. Awesome. Okay, let's move this. Let's move it out here. Let's open this chest up first. Oh, a pistol, a techlicky moon pump. Cool. All right. I wonder how many people are like, Chippy, you butcher every single name, why on earth do you even try? Because <laughs> I know I do, I know I butcher everything, I don't mean to, but I do. And more uh, modules as well, which I'm still not sure on what to do. I need to do a quick little Google search. It's weird how you can kind of like, go up here, like that's kind of mad. Oh, that's a little bit clunky. Uh, no, okay. Come on, let's see if we can do this. Hell yeah! 
Man, this makes like traveling planets so much more funner. Like, it's not extremely effective, but it's fun. If that makes sense. I don't know, it is, it's definitely faster. But like, on the scale of like, whether this is actually like, good or not, is a bit mad. Alright, do you know what, I'm gonna have to go back. I don't know if you guys saw it, but I saw a, uh, a grave chest, and uh, we opened one up in our original world, it didn't have anything good in there. But I want to see what it's like, so I'm gonna quickly kill these enemies off. Okay, let's dig down. Let's rob a grave. What you got inside of it? All right, just a bit of tungsten and some pixels. Okay, we should probably heal up. Did I actually? Hmm. Okay, that's a little bit slow, but that's okay. Now let's see. Any more avian stuff? Come on, or flora and stuff rather. Um, I feel like we're gonna get to the same area we were at before where it was kind of like the underground temple area Which would annoy me because the thing is like you kind of expect when you're doing this quest that one world would kind of be enough Like once you've found that world it should be enough Let's see. Can we scan anything while we're on here? Um, hmm. Man, these these guys look cool as all hell so do all of these people. These look cool. Alright, I feel like we're getting close because this planet kind of like represents the people a little bit. Although... Oh! No, 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 no! Okay. I don't know how long this is going to last me. I feel like I'm going to... It looks pretty wrecked already, to be honest. I feel like I'm going to wreck it so fast and I don't want to. Alright, what's this? A rope whip. <laughs> right, yeah, sure. Let's try out the Indiana Jones weapon. Um, it's is it rare? Legendary. Wow, man, that doesn't necessarily mean it's brilliant. By the way, it just means it's a cool weapon. You know what? That is brilliant. That is actually brilliant. Let's whip all these people up. Hell yeah! Which? Which? <laughs> no, that's cool. I like this. I like it's it's bizarre. It's bizarre, but it's equally cool and bizarre at the same time. I wonder how many people like. When it comes to legendary weapons, I always wonder when I get one or something like that. Oh, am I giving it a little rub? Am I like, hey, buddy, come on. Heal up. Let's give it a little rub. Yeah, I always wonder when I get these kind of weapons whether people, like, farm for days for them. All right, how long are you going to take here, buddy? Oh, he, he looks a little bit concerned. Um, okay, let's put it back in its side of its thing. And it works again. Awesome. <laughs> okay. It had a little time in its uh, in its pod. It's feeling a little bit better. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, no. Alright. How's it doing water? Not very good, apparently. Let's, um, let's see if we can find anything else. I don't feel like this world is going to offer us much more. But to be fair, we've had a lot of good stuff in this world. That's the thing. This world is, uh... It's not been without its, its fun. Oh, a TV! Why is there a TV? Alright, okay. Hey you, come and check out my amazing winners. Well, uh, I might rob the telly off you, buddy. I think that's about as far as I'm probably going to go with you. Considering we spent all of our money on a uh, hover bike that I've kind of wrecked in a... I mean, it's not even made it to the end of the episode, pretty much. I've kind of already wrecked it. Yeah, let's kill that dude. Oh. Alright, well, we are going to steal the telly. That's, uh, that's a given. Alright, buddy. What are you selling? Right, mercenary greaves. Egg shoot. Milk. No, I'm all right. Sorry, man. There's uh, there's nothing here that I can get. Like I can uh, I can warrant buying. Oh my god, it's a giant rat. Hmm. Okay, let's go back up here. Yeah, I think this is it for this planet. I think it's been a good ride though. I mean, like I say, we got some. Uh, we got a big temple out of it. We got a lot of uh, we got a lot of fun out of this like world. I don't feel like it's in vain that we uh, that we haven't found some more flora and stuff. I mean, there's other worlds to to find flora and stuff, isn't there? Hmm. All right. Well, anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I appreciate your constant support. It's really nice to uh, come by and see all the friendly faces in the comment section down below. Today's episode's been a bit of a bizarre one. I know we haven't kind of progressed with the main quest at all, but I think we've made some nice character developments. And it's always good to just explore, isn't it? I mean, what are these crates got? I'm so addicted to finding loot. Please, someone help me. Guys, have a... Ooh, is this the area we found? 
Because if not, I'm gonna I'm gonna check. Because if this is not, we could. Yeah. All right, finding more stuff. This must be the area we found, right? This has got to be it. Remember from the start? Huh. Is Stranger okay? Alright. Yeah, this has got to be it. Anyway, guys, have a great day. I'm going to have a little loot around here. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.